You know, there's a big double standard when it comes to the occult. I don't know if you've noticed it. Uh, say if you went to a doctor, yeah, like a, a medical doctor, and you were ill, and he gives you something. And, uh, you know, it takes a long time to get well. It takes you months. You don't look and say, that bloody doctor's crap. This medicine is bullshit. Medicine does not work. Look at this. It took me months to get well. It's crap. You don't. People don't do that. And they don't say, if they go to the hospital, or somebody they know goes to the hospital and they die, they don't say, well, it proves medicine's bullshit, isn't it? It's just a pseudoscience. It's a load of crap, you know. It's, you know, they died. It proves by definition that it doesn't work. It is just bullshit. You know, people don't do that. But they do do it with occultism. And that's the thing. If you do it with occultism and you get a result, you will get people that will say, yes, well, you know, it's just this, that, and the other. It's, yeah, it couldn't possibly be. You know, and there's an actual result. You know, it's it's about image, isn't it, really? And it's the same with other things, you know. Uh, not just that, but anything, you know. It, it, it's the same with finance, you know. You know, all the bank is screwed up. You know, the banking system collapsed, you know. They had to be propped up with lots of money. And yet nobody said, you know, all this stuff with banking, they don't know what they're doing. What are we doing giving them this money for, you know? It's just bullshit. It's just a pseudoscience. They don't know what they're doing. Let's just go back to gold coins and pile up a load of gold and just ignore them. It would probably make sense, but no one's actually said it in those words, in you know, that strongly. But they do do that with the occult. You know, it's this wonderful thing, isn't it? People do occultism, or they get someone to do it, it works. And then they'll say, well, you know, yes, but it worked because of blah de blah de blah de blah de blah you know, and it's also because occultisms don't, we don't, occultists don't name things we don't understand. You see, other people do. And they'll say, well, you know, the placebo effect. And that means straight away, they can say, well, you know, it was just the placebo effect. But what is the placebo effect? For a long time, they thought the placebo was about belief. Yeah, and we know in occultists, belief has power, but we also know that things like will and intent have power. And now they know, no, you don't actually, even if you know it's not, you know, that it, it, you know, this pill doesn't do anything, it's not actually an active pill. That if you intend it to work, it'll do something. You know, uh, we know more about this as occultists than they do, and we know that, that how you can make this weaker form of magic into a stronger form of magic. But it doesn't matter because they put a name on it. Say it's a political thing. If we have a name, we can say, yes, well, it is just this. And then people will believe them. They'll think they know what they're talking about when they don't. Because the fact of the matter is, you know, if you look at science and things like this, I'm not against science, but a lot of things outside of occultism love titles. Because, yeah, occultism, we've got titles, but people don't tend to use them, you know. Uh, you know, voodoo, priest, or this, or that, you know, or this many degrees of so-and-so, but we don't tend to use them that much. But they use them a lot, you know, and they use the titles to hide behind, you know, uh, you know, like every, like the title professor. It's great that because you'll get people that won't say what their researchers will say. Well, you know, I know because I'm a professor of so and so. Yes, but what is the research? And the thing is, now we live in the internet age, so you can put stuff, put their name into Google Scholar, and see what comes up. And sometimes there's not a lot. Sometimes there isn't a lot comes up at all, and sometimes there isn't anything in terms of citations. There's nothing there. Now, bear in mind, they were very crafty to make Google Scholar only for the academics. If you don't work in a university, you can't get on no matter how much research you've got, which is actually, in fact, the wrong thing, because now we can put them in, and you can look and find if they've got no citations. You know, it's, it's the titles they hide, they hide behind. Some people are doing stuff, some aren't, you know, it, it seems obvious you can put them into three classifications. You can put them into people who are key in their subject. Not many of them. And then you've got the other ones that are, they do a bit, and people might read the papers from time to time, but they're not really of that much importance. And the ones that do bug of all are of bug of all importance, and basically are just there. But as long as they've got the title, that's the thing. They're relying on titles and things like this. They, you know, they don't use it to show that they've got knowledge. Sometimes they're really using it to conceal when they don't. I mean, who the hell names something you don't understand? You know, you don't. I mean, that, does that make any sense? But that is the thought of thing we're talking about, whereby they'll name something you don't know anything about. You know, 
so you know if a shoe starts to fall upwards and all the shoes go upwards and I don't know why it works I you know you name it you call it well it is you know the shoe force shoe upwards force shoe velocity and straight away it seems like you know what you're talking about and when someone else says ah oh, but these shoes are falling up and say well you know it's shoe velocity and it's the same thing it's just you know that's the thing you've got to get past you know judge it fairly judge things on results fairly on their results that means if it gets a result then that's of some degree then it gets a result of some degree and if something doesn't get any results it doesn't get results try to judge occultism in the way you judge everything else and you will find just how valuable it is